What is the flipped classroom? In 2007, Jonathan Bergman and Aaron Sams, to end 2007, Jonathan Bergman and Aaron Sams, two chemistry teachers come to Gerter to make video recordings if their classes with the aim that students who, for various reasons, could not attend classes could access the contents. The realized that this recordings were also followed by an important number of students who didn't attend classes in person. In this way, the students took advantage of the classroom to solve doubts and perform different activities related to the contents. The flipped classroom is a pedagogical model in which students have access to contents of subjects outside of the classroom, using the material created by the teacher for this purpose. This allows access at any time. The work in the classroom consists of clarifying, deepening, working with and securing the concepts learned. Flipped classroom or inverted classroom owes its name to the characteristics that differentiate it from the traditional teaching methodology, because it is a learning model that follows an opposite process. In the traditional model the students go to class, in which the teacher transmits the knowledge. The students then review and analyze the contents in their home. On the contrary, in the flipped classroom the teacher provides the students with contents which will be discussed before seeing them in classroom. You can use videos, presentations, links to different web pages. When the students arrive in the classroom, they share the learned information with the rest of their classmates and make different tasks, cooperative and collaborative. The teacher, on the other hand, answers questions that have arisen values the acquisition of knowledge and guides the learnings of the students to consolidate them. Flipped classroom allows, through different technology, to provide students with a means of learning in which they direct themselves, being the teacher a guide of the whole process. This model allows learning to be adapted to the personal needs of each student. If students are unable to attend the class they can still access the contents and therefore do not fall behind with their studies. In addition, it provides the possibility of meaningful learning by sharing in the classroom with the rest of classmates what is learned at home. Blended learning or mixed learning, online and face-to-face, -face, can support the flipped classroom. Blended learning uses ICT to achieve greater efficiency in the teaching learning process, combining them with the face-to-face -face way. This model of learning also works the elements that are part of the cognitive dimension of Bloom's taxonomy. The objectives that are achieved in the classroom are the higher order dimensions such as, evaluation, synthesis, analysis and application. While the dimensions order, understanding and knowledge would be relegated to the tax to be performed autonomously by the student and facilitated by the teacher. Advantages of this model both for teachers and students, are diverse. On the one hand, students can access the contents learning at their own pace, and they can reflect on content. Meaningful learning is generated. The learning is focused on the student, allowing diversity. Also, students increase their responsibility in learning with their work outside and inside the classroom. Families, on the other hand, are more involved in the teaching learning process as they witness the whole process. To apply this learning model in the classroom, it is necessary to consider previously different aspects that facilitate its implementation and effectiveness in the application. The learning environment must be flexible for the students offering different means to facilitate their learning. The must present content graded in difficulty so that all students can access them without problems thus attending to diversity. The contents that are presented must be the most relevant for each topic. Finally, the teacher must use the classroom environment to reinforce and evaluate the knowledge acquired. The tools used to implement this model will depend on the objectives pursued at any given time. Although educational video may prove the easiest resource to use is not the only one. There are multiple tools that allow you to present the contents according to the specific needs that arise.